Well, it's one of the most sought-after violin competitions in the world with over $100,000 worth of prizes for the winner, putting 16 of the best young soloists to the test across eight days of thrilling performances in Queenstown and Auckland. Now, to tell us more about the Michael Hill International Violin Competition, please welcome to the cafe one of the selectors, Andrew Beer. Yes! Welcome, Andrew. Um, so you have performed all over the world as a soloist, uh, and you're now the concertmaster for the APO. So you do know your stuff. You've got the right credentials. Um, this competition is a really big deal, isn't it? What does it mean to win the title? Yeah, it's a humongous deal for the winner. I think it's a $40,000 prize. Um, you get to do a recording as well, a tour of New Zealand. Wow. But mainly it's the prestige that you get. It can be a launching point for someone's career, actually. OK, as a selector, how does the process work, selecting your finalists? Yeah, we had over 140 um, people apply this time. And there's five judges. I'm representing the APO. There's some top musicians from throughout Australasia, including um, Wellington and Sydney. Wow. Um, and we kind of each have different likes and dislikes about what we look for in players. So the five of us together, I think, make choices where we have a broad range of different styles. And that's a good thing. You want to have those broad range of different styles, don't you? Yeah. yeah. So, the, so these are the violinists of the future, aren't, aren't they? So I mean, what does it take to get to this level? I mean, how many hours of practice? Yeah, these are really some of the top violinists in the world in their 20s. Um, it's a ton of hours that you put in. I remember when I was doing competitions at that age, it's about eight hours a day. So wow. not much time for a social life when but, you're preparing. But at least you sound good, so your neighbours aren't going to yell at you because when you start, obviously, <laughs> it's, a, it's one of those instruments you go like, oh, little Betty started playing violin. I'm not so sure this is going to work. Yes, yeah, so I think little Betty, who lives next door to me, needs to come and see Andrew. <laughs> <laughs> I hope she's not watching. Keep it up. You're sounding great. OK, um, whereabouts are these finalists actually from? All over the world. I think we have Kazakhstan, China, Japan, um, South Korea, America, one from New Zealand actually as well, right. Ben oh, Baker, wow. local. Right. Cool. Yeah. Um, there's a lot from South Korea, isn't there? Why is that? They are, um, it's hard to say really, but they have great teachers in South Korea and I think they have a great work ethic as well. They really put in the hours that they need to. Mm. Okay, and this competition is open to the public to come and watch, but also for local musicians to get involved. Ah, yeah, so actually for the semi-final round, we have some musicians um, throughout New Zealand that are playing with the candidates, so Brilliant. it's a chamber music style. And then also for the final round, which is tomorrow at 7.30 p.m. in Town Hall, um, anyone can come and they also get to vote on the audience prize. So anyone can say who their favorite is. Oh, that's always fun. And there's a live stream of it as well. There is, yes. Yeah. So if you can't make it, just watch online and then submit your vote who you like the most. OK, I have to ask you about Michael Hill's violin, because it's, it's quite a special violin. What is it again? And yeah, I'm... it's called the Guadagnini from Guadagnini. the 18th century. Wow. Yeah. And how much is that worth? Uh, um, <laughs> it's worth most more than most homes, even in Auckland, actually. It's really? a lot of money, yeah. Wow. So what does he do with it? Well, he, keep, he's, he plays himself, actually. He's a real violin lover, very passionate about the violin. But he also, every time we have a winner, they get to play on it for a few months when they do their winner's tour, which is a great privilege. What a fantastic support for the community, Michael Hill. You know, not only you know, helping with the competition, but of course giving the winners the, his prized possession to play with for a couple of months. That is fantastic. It's like letting like, a learner go in your, in your Maserati, Yeah, isn't, isn't it? it? He's, he's amazing. Nice. I've, I've rarely met anyone who's more passionate about violin playing than he is. Wow. Really, really great oh, now you've got two violins here. This one, what, this is the one you're going to let us have a go on, because yes. it's obviously the one that you don't care if, if, if something bad happens to it. I, I do care, but less important let's than that get, one. And this is your one, which is, which is spectacular as well. That one's also old. Not as spectacular as Michael Hill's violin, but it's, it's quite a special That's one That's a as car, well. and this is like maybe the push bike you had when you were five. <laughs> <laughs> well, it'll probably make the same noise. Um, so do you two want to have a go? Can you teach Mel something? Yeah, have absolutely. you ever played the violin? Yeah. I'm yeah. left-handed, so do it, is that a problem? Uh, let's be ambidextrous today. OK, so I have to play it right-handed. Is that yeah. what most left-handers have to do? They do, yeah. You okay. can do it. <laughs> OK, right. Well, yeah, yeah, just under the chin under there. there. That's it. OK, where do I hold my hand there? Yeah, just use that there to hold the violin up okay. so it doesn't fall down. And then we take the bow. It's very light. On. Got it. Okay. Put your thumb and middle finger here where that horseshoe sort of shape okay. is, and then index up here with the rubber. Is that right? Yeah. And then try and play the bow on the middle two strings if you can, kind of back and forth. And you want to keep. How heavy? Um, medium, say. Nice. Pretty good. You're a natural. Do you want to play a duet together? Okay. Yeah, let's do a All duet. Right. Okay. Oh, a duet. Okay. Okay. Should I rock it? <laughs> you keep doing that. You can I'll make this sound good. I'd be so surprised. How far back do I go? Like. That, that'll do, yeah. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> right, right, you 
put that down, Mal. Okay. Let, let's just hear Andrew so play. I lost my mojo and couldn't do all that cool, cool like. No, but something. you that was actually really okay. good. Um, and then, can you play something for us, Andrew? Sure, I'll just play a little Without bit of a volley for you. Okay. Yeah, no, yeah. no, it doesn't need any accompaniment. Yes. <laughs> all right, nice. <laughs> Thank you so much, Andrew. The Michael Hill International Violin Competition Grand Final is on tomorrow at the Auckland Town Hall. Go to Ticketmaster for tickets, or you can watch it live at violincompetition.co.nz.